Okay, bye lady. Don't follow me. Okay. Yo! Let's play Our Lady of Sorrow. Hello and welcome to Hula Noob Play Short Indie Horror Games. Today I'm going to play a game by Tooth and Claw. And it looks really cool. Uh, it's about, I guess, a creepy statue of Our Lady of Sorrow. And I'm all into creepy statues. Um, if you've watched my Medicine Let's Play, I was all about that. Super creeped out, you know. Um, so... An unmarked tape discovered in the archives of an abandoned church containing strange footage was recently discovered. The tape was deemed extremely dangerous by the Catholic Church and was hidden away. But somehow we got our hands on it. So let's watch it and, you know, probably nothing bad will happen. Why would it? This game is intended to be played oh, in one setting. Headphones, I think. Last one I didn't see. So I hope this is not like flat flick. Fl it could be flickering lights because all those VHS type of games they usually have flickering lights. So if you're sensitive to that, just you know, maybe be careful. <laughs> this tape and its contents are the property of the diocese of blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Okay. Any attempt to copy, redistribute, or publicly display this tape should be considered dangerous. Oh, sorry! May the Krampus take me. <laughs> this tape must only be played under the strict supervision of members of the church. Well. Well. Is God a member of the church because he's always watching? Ireland, 1998. Oh, God. Don't want to look back on that year. I was a teenager back then and. Ugh. So whatever happens here can't be worse than my teenage years at school. <laughs> I like the looks. Good soundtrack. Kilcree Abbey. Built in 1458 as a monastery, the abbey has seen many things. Viking raids, fires, rituals and black masses. The abbey is best known as the burial site of many famous priests and renowned nuns and people of the Catholic faith. The Great Tower was once used as a lookout. This one? Mm-hmm. Anything? What's this? Kilcree Abbey. The entrance and outer walls of the abbey have been rebuilt many times. We know this by the look and shape of the different stones and how some have been eroded by the elements more than others. Walls that have fallen have been left as is. Archaeologists have found many things between the walls. Such as old animal bones, coins, artifacts and even small... Some small human bones. Some? Like they don't know which one? Ooh. Open the gate! Okay. I like the idea with the little info plaques. That's very realistic. Ooh. The abbey is home to many tales and myths from across the centuries. Stories of ancient monks stowed away beneath the mossy stone, buried in prayer. Stories of sieges and bloodshed of the Irish at the hands of English nobles. Oh yes. Oh yes. If you're not from Great Britain, the Irish don't really like the English. Which is why a lot of Irish people very much celebrated the death of the Queen when it happened this year. The most famous story of all is the story of Anne Kalek. Kalek? Oh man, I don't know. Um, I, I, you know, I, I, I cannot pronounce it. I'm really sorry. Known to locals as the Lady of Sorry. Okay, Anne Kalek. Sounds very nice though. Um, is it Gaelic? Or was that the Scottish one? I don't know. Sorry. I studied all this, but yeah, nah, it's been a while. The tale of the Lady of Sorrow has been passed down through many years and the true story is heavily debated amongst local historians. What is common throughout these different tellings is the tale of a young witch who long ago set a curse upon the local priest. The priest roused the locals who burned her alive in the very church that stands upon these grounds. It was said by the locals who watched her burn that the weeping image of the Virgin Mary appeared upon her face and then she cackled as the flames engulfed her. <laughs> the priest commanded her remains to be thrown in the well and the entrance sealed. That well remains sealed to this day. You know what? That reminds me, uh, reminds me of the really bad movie The Unholy but, uh, based on the really good book um, which... I always forget 
the title of the book. I talked about this in another game and I also forgot it. Uh, but I will post it in my video description. So if you're interested, if you like reading horror stories, I can post it. It's a very famous author, actually. Um, okay, locked. I want to take a look at everything and then we can back to the creepy dark door. That is certainly our doom. I really like this. This is a very beautiful environment. It's also locked. Looks like it needs a key. Oh. Oh ho ho ho. Yeah, in that book, it's about basically um, a miracle happening in a little British village. Wait, where am I going? And uh, the question is, is it a miracle or is it a curse? Woohoohoohoo! Uh, I don't see anything. Oh, okay. There's the flashlight. Right click with the mouse. Yeah, I had this so often, like F is a really good, just a tip for developers, F is a really good button for the flashlight because, you know, that's where people expect it to be. Oh, there it is. Um, oh, okay. But I know that not a lot of developers really adhere to this very well established standard, so just trying things out always works. Well, mostly. Oh, I wouldn't go here. That's... Oh, uh, okay. Pick up the church key. Okay, bye lady. Don't follow me. Okay. No! <laughs> Can I die? No. I couldn't have escaped that. That was basically built in the game, right? Yes. Oh, I thought the gate was closed. Oh. Okay. A little bit yeah, I'm a little bit spooked. Just a little bit. I like a good witch tale. There we go. Why why ugh. why do I want to go here? Is that stone people? That would unnerve me. Oh there she is. Uh, hi lady. Uh, looks like something fits here. Okay. Um, here is where the image of the Virgin Mary appeared during the burning of the witch. The church long ago placed a statue here. Why would they? Why would they? The locals used to hold communion here in hopes she would appear again. What? Why do you want to... Like, that was a witch... Some say that on cold autumn nights you can faintly smell burning flesh and wood and sometimes even the cackling of the witch. You can smell that? How ca how does cackling smell? I know, I'm, I'm trolling. I know what is meant. Do you have something that I can put in there? Huh. So... Uh What do I... Oh, there's something... That wasn't there before. A oh, lady. Pick up the chalice. Uh, thank you, creepy... Creepy statue. So... Now we're looking for her. Oh, there's one more. Do you have something? Why don't you have something in your hands? Mm. Very disappointing. I like that it's basically nondescript weather. Like, it's windy. It could be any time of the day. It's very well done. Ooh! It's like spikes driven through her. Oh. Okay. There you go. Oh. You know, I don't... Oh no, it's raining. Oh, the stone people are gone. Oh, they're not gone. There she is. Pick up the key. K. 
Okay. Oh. Why would I all do that? Like, if I would just... Oh yeah, that's the, the person in the VHS tape did this. So maybe they had, like, some sort of motivation to do this. So that's even the bigger mystery, what kind of motivation I would have. I have the key. I do have the key though. Uh, don't I? Didn't I pick up the key? What the what? Or do I have to go here? Ah, no, I don't, ew, no. What are you doing here? So, do you watch House of Dragons? Raise the power, which, which, which did you prefer? Okay. I preferred House of Dragons. I know it's a depressing slog, but I really enjoyed it. Because Rings of Power could not get into it. I don't know why. And I love Lord of the Rings. Pick up Crypt Key. Oh, finally! Why am I saying finally? It will be my doom. Oh, no. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, the wind is picking up. I like this. This is really well done. It's beautiful. Weirdly, also, I haven't played that many games in old churchyards like this. Okay. So what do I want to do here? Turn on the music box. I'm bloom. That I would do that. Okay. Why did I do that? Let's go? Oh, it can leave. Oh, I can't. Shit. Maybe I can go into the tower. I actually never went. Did I? I didn't. Oh, I didn't. No, there's nothing. Oh, that changed now. Okay. Enter the well? No, why? The prayer of protection. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle, bear protection against the wickedness, a uh, wickedness and snares of the devil. Devil, double, 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 double. Amen. 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 Shadow of thy wings will it will I take. Oh. Oh shit! 
I thought that was the ending. No, I don't... I don't want to go. There's a really, really, really fantastic found footage movie. I think it's even Irish. Um, where basically a priest is sent to an old... Not really derelict church, because I think it's still active, but to an older church where weird stuff happens. And um, I don't... I can't say more because I don't want to spoil anything but it is it's a slow burner but if you like slow burning fun footage it is one of the best like I talk about this whenever I can I mention this movie um, even though I don't know the title <laughs> um, I will put it in the video description as well this will be a delight for you a book recommendation Ugh. and a movie oh Which direction? I don't know. They're both creepy. <gasps> oh. Oh. They remind me of those um the the people of Pompeii. You know, the remnants of the people of Pompeii that they found. Oops. Uh So basically, yeah, like, uh, just these sculptures of the corpses that were left over. It's really striking and incredibly sad. Oh. So I will go this way, right? <laughs> like, why would I go the other way? see something oh I would I mean good thing I'm in water because I'm shitting my pants right now <laughs> I don't wanna I mean I don't wanna what am I doing here so the person taking this video I think they have like a like they have the camera on their head right um they know what they're doing it seems like they were sent on a mission to do something to do a specific ritual because they don't freak out and they kind of they just know what they do you know what they're about to do which i i don't think it's it's a cool thing. I don't think it will be... Place candle. Okay. Oh, okay. So I have to go into both directions. Okay. I did not expect this to be this long. Um, I saw... Like, I usually click um, on... If, if other people post it on the itch page, I click on the video... On one, you know, random video just to see how long it is. And I saw one... It was like 12 minutes long and we're veering on you know over 20 here i mean i always take my time my sweet sweet time i know that but still that's uh i i thought this would be a lot shorter but i enjoy it so it's not like you know i, I say this pleasantly surprised okay like honestly i don't want to really it's still the right way round those crosses, so that's good. I mean, I always usually take longer because I'm worse with puzzles than other people. <laughs> and I do explore and I talk a lot, 
you know, that's a good combination for just taking your sweet time. I love the sound effects in this. This, this, the echo to make a really, to make you know how big all this is. There you go. Oh God. <laughs> mm. Oh, you're turning away? That is worse than before. And you're also getting very big. It's also not something I enjoy. I also like that the flickering is not too much. I've I've played VHS found footage games that were just wild. Oh god, it's the stairs. Okay. Oh, I'm I will go up the In the shadow of thy wings will I take refuge. I am a vessel. I am a vessel. I am a vessel. If God is our father, then Satan must be our cousin. <laughs> oh, it's kind of a pray for us. Wouldn't it be the brother? Because we're all God's children. Oh! Oh, that's the person! Oh, they made it out. Oh, oh but we're all bloody. But we made it out. Okay. Oh shit. Uh. Oh shit, we can't leave. Oh. Oh, you fuckers. Oh, I knew you were. Oh. 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 The big old monster was sacrificing me. You have reached the end of this tape. Please seek the help of a member of the Catholic Church immediately. No, I'm good. It's fine. It's totally fine. We believe this tape to be a vessel, a conduit for the evil spirits to spread their plague. It is the ring! <sighs> this game is a vessel. This tape is a vessel. Oh, that's a cute idea. I love it. Please dispose of this tape as soon as possible. She has escaped. Samara! <sighs> that's from the ring, by the way. Please pray with us. No, I, I really don't. I'm, I'm, I'm an atheist. I feel weird. Thank you for playing. Yes, Dan. Oh, great game. I really enjoyed this. This had a really unique 
look and feel to it. Um, I, I love playing fun footage, but you know, um, a lot of them kind of have the same feel and the same storylines and so I always look out for ones that kind of yeah do something else with it and I really enjoyed this and it's weird that there's so few um at least in the in the last couple of years that I played um indie horror games like the very short ones that play with this environment you know like an old churchyard um because it is ripe you know for inspiration very beautiful done. I really, I also like that these these interludes. You know, the that probably someone, <laughs> someone from the Catholic Church with like iMovie edited in. <laughs> probably not iMovie. It was like ninety eighty eight, uh, ninety ninety eight. So probably was some like video editing program. Um, yeah, just beautifully done. I will totally follow um, the developer on, on itch and see what else they did. Uh, very lovely, very lovely work. Um, also to the viewers, I hope you enjoyed this as well. How did you like it? Um, what do you think happened? I think... So I think the witch was in the statue. And I think the the big monster was probably one of its its victims or whatnot. Um, so you know, and it's about like sacrificing to that witch monster, I guess, that's hiding in the statue, because I think that's the thing that that's why we saw those wings. Um, that it it was basically, and I don't get why they would uh, go and pray to the statue if they knew that this was shown in connection with the witch's death you know like a witch's curse man that's you don't don't do you don't get a witch's curse you know those are not really good um but yeah i uh if, if, if you have any ideas about the story then please tell me in the comments um or if you notice anything else if you have any information on the uh, religious aspects of the lady of sorrow for example you know also pl please feel free to share i'm always happy to learn something new and uh, if you're new to this channel, you know, and you enjoyed what you saw, well, you, you're welcome to subscribe. And I promise you, if you're uh, on the on this mission, you know, and, and you shoot this video and you want to find out what's what's behind it. And I'm like the witch. Uh, I will not let you be sacrificed for me. You know, I will. I mean, look, the weather was shit. It was raining. You were probably exhausted. And at the end, you looked like really beaten up, you know, and I would just be like, you know what? just go you know just leave have a coffee somewhere go to your hotel room you know relax read a book just you know because it was a heck of a year you know maybe we'll just all be nicer to each other so subscribe <laughs> anyways i hope you had a good time i hope you had a wow no wait i <laughs> I hope you had a great time. I hope you have a wonderful day. Damn it. Forgot my own. Like, I don't even know why this started. And actually, I never intended to have like an outro that I sing myself because I actually have an outro where I also sing myself. And I started this and I don't know how it started, but it started. And now I'm doing this and I feel obligated to do it. But then I forget even like this really simple text. Good Lord. Anyways, um, have a great time and see you next time. Bye bye. This is my self-recorded outro song so I don't get hit with copyright claims. If you subscribe, you subscribe to a lot of fun tutorials, reviews and let's plays.